in terms of protecting your bones, we're getting more and more evidence that essentially we don't quite have enough sunshine in this country. And the majority of people are vitamin D depleted. Vitamin D testing is becoming very commonplace. And in terms of strengthening bone, vitamin D and calcium supplements together uh, do seem to be quite useful. When it comes to cartilage, it's a little bit more complicated. The most famous options have been something called glucosamine, um, which is a key constituent of cartilage. Uh, we've had lots of studies looking at up to hundreds of thousands of people trying to work out if glucosamine works. Well, we know it's not growing cartilage back. And the evidence to suggest it's slowing down cartilage loss is quite weak, but it's relatively harmless uh, and, and it's reasonable to take. The next is chondroitin, similar, probably even, if anything, slightly less evidence uh, for its use. But I think glucosamine and chondroitin supplements may uh, provide some, some help. In terms of turmeric and the anti-inflammatories, we don't as yet have any clear medical evidence that that's doing anything, uh, I'm afraid to say.